Hey y'all, this is Rochelle and welcome or welcome back to my channel, Rochelle's Plans. Today we're here to plan for the week of September the 12th through the 18th in my Erin Condren Hourly Life Planner. Y'all, before we get started, I just want to show y'all my cover here. If you watched my seasonal Erin Condren seasonal fall seasonal surprise box. You saw that this cover here came in the box. This was the cover that I chose and I absolutely love it. It's called the watercolor leaves, ombre, ombre leaves or something like that. But yeah, I love it. Um, this Cover was exclusive to the box, so it is not available to purchase. But I just wanted to show y'all because as soon as I did that unboxing, I immediately took off my other cover and changed it for this one. So she is all ready for fall. Now, before we get started, let's look at last week or let's look at this week's spread because today is Sunday that I'm planning this, uh, doing this video, and this is how last week's spread turned out this is, i think this is kit 108 i want to say but anyway it's a sarah marie kit i love 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 this apple orchard kit uh, we had a busy week last week typical um this past week was memorial memorial day labor day so it was labor day well you know what i had a four-day weekend i was off friday and off monday i didn't go back to work until tuesday but you can see here where um i did my classic monthly ryan had uil choreo on monday i had a package delivered from wrong wrong she had a ryan had a volleyball game i watched um pieces of her on netflix I did some laundry. Let's see what else. Um, Bath and Body Works had a sale. They're always having sales. I had a follow up appointment with my oral surgeon. Um, Friday night was Friday Night Lights. We had a football game. Saturday, my son had a cross country race, as he does again, or they both do. There's a game. Again, an away game again this Friday night, but it's not that far away, thank God. And then my son next Saturday does have another cross country meet or race. But yeah, y'all. So we're going to be flipping to this week. Now, I'm going to show y'all this is a September week two. Y'all remember that I separated or showed you guys, showed y'all the stickers that I was going to be using for my planner in that um, September sticker kits video. If you haven't seen it, um, I'll put a card somewhere. I may leave it. I may leave a link in the description box, but I shared what kits and sticker books I was going to be using for the month of September. And this is the kit I'm using for September week two. And it is called, I don't know what it's called. This is a kit from last year or the year before last, maybe just last year. But y'all, I love it. It's so pretty. I didn't use it last year and I wanted to go ahead and use it this year. So it's kit 351. Let me just show y'all really quickly. And you can tell the kits that are not from this season or this year because of First off, because of these script stickers here, and then also how the weekend sticker is. And then I don't think at the, yeah, I'm trying to see. I don't think that the doodle sheet was offered last year whenever I ordered this. So here is the sampler sheet. I got off track. The full boxes. I really don't use the full boxes anymore. And then here is the washi strip sheet. And then my add-on stickers here. Sidebar, ombre boxes, scripts, pattern boxes. I've got the individual date headers or date covers. Some more of uh, the thick washi. 
and labels and checklists. So, yeah, I don't normally use the full boxes because I have changed the way I plan and it doesn't, the way I'm planning now, I have a lot or my plans take up a lot of room and I don't necessarily have the space for the full boxes. Now, sometimes if I use the full boxes, I can, you can layer on top of the full boxes other functional stickers, but I really don't feel like doing that. Well, I don't know. That's just a tip. If you use full, if you use the full boxes, you can always layer a functional box on top of the full box. So that way you can make that full box functional. So that way you can write in it. So that way you don't lose up or lose too much real estate on the page. I hope that makes sense. It's Friday the 16th. Yes, it is. So Saturday and then Sunday. So I hope y'all had a great weekend. Like I said, mine was really, really busy. I mean, really busy. Friday, we drove, or I drove to Rockwall for the football game. So here's what I did. I got off work, and I get off work at 345. So I got off work. I had to stop by the credit union, and then I came home. So I get off at 345. I only work 15 minutes away. But when I got off work, I had stopped by the credit union. Where are my washi strips? Right here. Okay. So, yeah, so I got off work and I went to the credit union. Then when I got home, I went, I think I want to use these at the top. Wait, let's see here. Hold on. Do I want to use, it's hard trying to tell a story and trying to, it's like trying to narrate and plan at the same time. That's a lot, y'all. It is a lot to try to stay, to concentrate on what you're saying. I like this one here, but I don't want to use that. Now, then I'm thinking about if I use this at the top, then I use this here at the bottom, will that clash? I really could use this one here at the top with the day hair, and then bring this down at the bottom. I could definitely do that, but I also kind of want to do like this farmer's market. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Let's just pull this one here at the top. <laughs> Let's just do this here at the top. I'm not going to white out any lines, y'all. Let's see. I think I want to do it. Should I come down? Let's see how to do last week. I think I left the 6 o'clock line off. I really don't want to cover up any of okay you can see through the sticker so let's let's white out the 6 a.m and then let's just see how this looks i'm not going to white out the days of the week because they may be covered up if not covered up then the pattern is not going to be too um, intense. Well, you it won't be so intense where you can see underneath. Y'all, I'm losing, using here this slice tool. Um, I will have it linked in the description box below. I got it off of Amazon years ago when I started planning. My other um, slice tool, not slice tool, but what is it that, that, I'm, that I used to use? my craft knife, it, for whatever reason, it gives me 
a little bit of problems whenever I go to close it. So I'll just say, you know what, let me just use this one. You know what, I can't get that off, I'm not gonna worry about it. So anyway, when I got off from work, let's see, do I wanna put this up here at the top? Like that. Um, see, the thing is, I don't want to cover up any of, I didn't wanna cover up any of that washing. But when I come to put in my fun days, it'll probably get covered up. Let's pull this back. I'll flip this back on its own, and then we can just do this like so. So we'll put this here. Okay. Okay, y'all. So now back to my Friday. So I get off work on Friday at 345. I go to the credit union. I come home and sit down for a little bit because I know I have like an hour and 10 minute drive. So I come home and sit down, um, you know, use the restroom, just kind of relax a little bit, play with Ryder. And then I leave. I leave and I go to Chick-fil-A because I... Wanted to get something to eat before I left because I know, like, when I, I did the, I put the address in my navigation and it said an hour and eight minutes. And I had to get my mind right because I had to drive through downtown Dallas. And uh, so, yeah, through rush hour because I did not leave the house until like five, I want to say 530. The game started at seven. So um, that's like right in the middle of rush hour. And there's always construction. I mean, it's, it's we moved here in 2011. And I swear, the construction is still ongoing, still ongoing. So we just say, you know what? They're going to always be fixing on something here. But anyway, at least they're fixing it, right? Or attempting to fix it. So I got to the game, I want to say, around um, maybe like 7.05 because I stopped at Chick-fil-A before I left because I didn't want to eat anything from the concession stand. Because usually at the football games, I'll get, usually I will have nachos. Well, I didn't really want that. So I decided to stop before the game. And that kind of put me behind because I did not leave the house when I said I was going to leave. I didn't do that. Go figure. So I didn't leave at the time I said I was going to leave. And then I thought about like not stopping to get something to eat. And I was like, you know what? No, you got to stop because um, I just need to stop. I didn't eat a lot that day uh, at work. So I was kind of hungry. I'm not just too terribly hungry, but I was hungry enough where I needed to stop and give me something to eat. Okay, let's put down our fun days. Tomorrow is chocolate milkshake day. I'm going to put this right here. So you know what? I am still covering up some of the washing. Tuesday the 13th is positive thinking day. So make sure no negative thoughts. Try to stay positive. For positive thinking day, the 14th is hug your hound day. Ryder gets hugs every, every day. So hug your hound day. Make sure you are hugging um, your fur babies and giving them some love. The 16th Friday is world guacamole day. Oh, and it's Working Parents Day. Look at that. So, World Guac Day and Working Parents Day. So, we get two. Let's see here if how I can do this. 
Move that up some. So now I'm going to put this one here. Okay. And then Saturday the 17th, we have two more. We have cleanup day on Saturday. And then also it's apple dumpling day. I might need to move this down some because it's covering up some of the A in day. So let's see here. We'll just do it like this. There we go. All right. So we have our fun holidays in. That doesn't go right there. That goes back here. So we'll just put this back here. All right, y'all. Now for the bottom washi. I guess I can do this truck here, this farmer's market truck. This is cute. And then I like to I always go a little bit below this line here at the bottom because I reserve a little bit of space between 7.30 and 8 for my thin washi. Okay, we got that side done. Now let's come over and do the left side. Okay, so now we have that down. Um, I don't know what I was talking about. Because guess what? Guess who came in? Dion did. Didn't I tell y'all this last week? Y'all, this slice tool is so good. I like it. It's really sharp, but see how small that tip is? I've had this for a long time. And you can see I don't use it that much, but it's really, really sharp. And then the grip is really nice it's to hold it. Okay, now let's come in with, I think I want to bring in the orange with this thin washi strip here. So we'll use this piece here and put this down here. I just like how this looks. There's a little piece of lint that was on the washi there, the washi strip. All right, so we're going to put this down, and then we'll come in and do the same on the right side, but I just like how this looks. I was thinking about doing it at the top also, but not so much now because... Underneath the washi, I'm going to bring in the weather. And then underneath the weather is going to be the space for my scripture for the day. So, y'all, so Friday, I got to the football game. I think at about, what did I say, 7, 7.05, something like that. Game was over like around 9.30 and we lost. They shouldn't have, but we did. So it was over around 9.30. We left and made it home about 10.45. I didn't, I got it, I took my shower, got in the bed and everything, but I was trying to edit a video to go up for Saturday. And so, this is crooked. And so, um... I really didn't get to sleep until about, I think it was like 12, 25, I want to say. Let's do this. Let's see if I can get this straight. I think it was about 12, 25. And my son's meat was, you know what? I'm leaving it. It was, sorry if that was loud. 
it was in Weatherford. So that was about 45 minutes away. I butchered that. It's about 45 minutes away, but when I put it in my GPS Friday night, it said about an hour, it would take an hour or something for us to get there. So I had like three alarms set because I took him, he could have ridden the bus, but I ended up taking him and I did not want him to be late. He had to be there at least by 7.15 to check in and everything. So we got there, left the house around 6.15. So I woke up, I think it was around five o'clock. I let him sleep to about 5.30, and we left the house at about 6.15. Y'all, it's a whole ordeal trying to get that boy up and out the door. So that way he is not late. I mean, it's a whole ordeal getting him up. So usually my husband... Uh, wakes him up during the week because I'm just like, mm -mm, I don't have time. But um, let's see, do I have any more of these? Or is, are those the only ones that I have? But typically, mm -mm, I don't have a lot. See, back then when I was ordering these stickers, I was, I'm going to alternate. I wasn't ordering the things that I order now. Let's see. So here, so we'll just put it here at the seven o'clock line. So this line is for my scripture. No, for the weather. The second line here where the um, dot is, is for my scripture. Each day. And we're just going to alternate. And now I'll come in offline and notate the weather because I don't have it ready at the moment. So, yeah, y'all, I had a busy weekend. I was tired. When I say tired, I was tired, very tired. I drove an hour and 10 minutes to the football game Friday night, go to sleep, and get up Saturday. Is that right? Saturday morning and drive 45 minutes to the cross country meet. We got there, like I said, around 7 o'clock. We left there around 9. We got to the house. I think it was around 10.45, and my son and I both went to sleep, and I think I woke up. It was, uh, I think it was 2.45, so I essentially slept from 10.45 to 2.45, and I needed that. Ryan had gone to work. She had to work Saturday, but yeah, y'all, and then today, Sunday, we painted her senior parking spot. What what we did was since she had to leave and go to cheer practice, we did as much as we could. At first she was like, well, it doesn't really make sense to um, go today when I can just go next week because next week is, see, this is cute. This is a bigger sticker though. It will take up more space. I want to use this one though. I think I want to do my sidebar a little bit different this week. I mean, I could just use that one. Let's just do it. Oh, you know what? It is a lot shorter because typically I come down to the nine o'clock line. Mm, I'll just do it anyway. We really don't have to do it today. We can just do it next week. I was like, no, we need to at least do something today. That way, it's not, um, I think I may put, let's do, what am I going to do here? 
I need to this week. Let's do, let's use one of these and hold on y'all. I'm going to use that checkbox there and I'll do the meals. Yeah, I'll do the meals. So I'll put this week there and we'll just do this here like so. Okay, so it's going to be for our meals and then I could use this ombre box for Mm, I think I want to do for my to-dos and I guess I could use also see that's kind of long seven I guess I'll do to do or should I do don't forget let's do don't forget is there a don't forget yeah let's do don't forget because I have some things I need to make sure that I don't forget to do this week. We're going to put this to do back. And if I need it, if I decide to use it, I'll bring it in. Or why did I put this back? I didn't mean to put that back. Let's use this one here. I was trying to, I was thinking I was going to put the, um, my habits down, but I don't have room. Yeah, I don't have room for my habits. So we'll just put this here. And what's really bothering me is that this is blue and not orange. I love these non-traditional fall colors though. So don't forget. And then let's come in and we're going to mark the week. I guess I'm going to use the asterisk and I'm going to use orange. So it's the 12th through the 18th. Okay, I don't know if y'all can see that or not. All right, we're going to do it and see how this looks. Now we're going to just see. And then I could always bring in the, um, the weather somewhere else. And then I'm also looking here at my plans and these washi, the washi. The date headers are crooked. So I am going to switch that up also. But I may do that off camera though. Let's fold this bag. Y'all, she is getting thick with the sticker kits I started planning in this planner in April because before I came to my EC hourly I was in the plum paper hourly and so from April through to now which is September this planner is thick let me tell you and also too I have pieces of my sticker kits that I didn't unused portions of my sticker kits in the back of this planner also but yeah this planner is thick yeah that is it but I got plans for that so we have our we've got the shell down we got the washi down the top washi the date covers the bottom washi the weekend sticker, we got my sidebar sticker down, and I may come in and put something here. I'm not sure just yet, but we got that now. See, I was thinking about using this here, but I can't because these are take up so much space. 
but that's okay. So now let's bring let's bring in my let's notate my YouTube videos. They will work. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to bring in my work stickers. Let's do that first. Let's bring in these work stickers. And y'all, this is my binder from Chrissy Ann Designs that um, I keep all of her, like my functional box stickers in. Box stickers, my functional stickers in. So do I want to do another black and white work? Or do I have, okay, do I have any orange? I don't think that color goes. That's too light. That's light. You know what? This one would have worked, but I don't have but three of those. And this orange could possibly go, but I don't have enough of that one either. This is navy, so that's not gonna work. And so I guess we're gonna use the white ones. But let me just look one more time. Yeah, these are the wrong colors. Yeah, so we'll just use black and white. Black and white it is. And I do work every day this week. Isn't that so sad? It's just so sad every day this week. But you know what? I do thank God that I am able-bodied and can work and do have a job where I can go in to work and make money to help provide for my family. So it's not all that bad in the bigger scheme of things. So we're going to put this here, even though I start work here at 7.15, we're just going to put it here like so, and then just write out the scripture. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Each day. Y'all, that, be careful. I just jam my finger, stab my finger with this, um, these tweezers here. Where did they go? Okay. I was like, am I missing some stickers? I'm going to soak my finger in some peroxide when I get done with this video. Jeez, I don't know how I did that. Just being careless. Okay. So we have our work stickers down. That looks really good to me. I like that. All right, got our work stickers down. I'm done with this sheet here for right now. Done with that sheet. Now let's come in with my YouTube videos. I am going to place this sticker here on the nine o'clock line every day. And like I said the other week or last week, we're going to hope for the best. But y'all know what? I put out two videos today, so I'm doing good. Okay. All right. So now we're going to bring in my Sarah Marie stickers binder here and bring in or get out our stickers here. All right, so we have that there. Now let's come in with our church sticker. And do I have a church sticker on here? I 
we do right here. So we will put this in. Let's just use this blue one here. Okay. So right there, church is at eight o'clock on Sunday. Now, what I like to do is come in and put in my to-dos. And how are we gonna do that? I think I have, um, if I didn't use them all, I have to do stickers in this binder. Are they in here? No, they're not. They're in my planner cape binder here. Where are my to dos? And I need to make, ooh, I'm out, y'all. I only have one. Jeez, Louise, I guess I could just do, got that one there, and then I have this one here, they're not the same, doggone it, I can't use that one, okay, plan B, I'm just going to put down my checklist, and I don't think these are going to be the right, oh, they'll work, right? They're a little bit off. One, two, three, four, five. They're a little bit off. I'm gonna cut this off. Um, one, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna cut these two off. So I don't need seven checklists. Okay, y'all, so we have all of our to-do or checklist in. And I think now that I want to come in with to mark down my daughter's um, cheer practices. So we're going to do that. Use, so these will go, these here. So that's what we're going to use. We're going to use these here. So she has practice on Wednesdays at 6.30. I'm not going to put it in the box. I thought about putting it in the box, but I changed my mind. So 6.30. And then on Sundays at 1.30. And of course, she has high school practice. I don't know those days. And then she works too. I think she works tomorrow at five o'clock, but I'll check with her and just make sure and get her scheduled for the week. And then I'll come in and write that down. My son has basketball, not basketball. He has cross country pictures on Wednesday. So I'm not going to put, I know I have a picture day, but how big is this one? I don't know how big that is. I'm not sure. Maybe I don't. So things like trash day, 
payday maybe i'll go ahead and do a while um recording i was gonna say i could do it off camera but i guess i'll go ahead and just do it while um filming oh i have more here i had more i didn't know i had more of those well i don't think or see i don't know where they are but i'm pretty sure i have stickers that say picture day and stuff like that so what i'll do is i am going to notate it with a pattern box so he has picture day on wednesday what i want to use uh -huh. let's see I know I have some don't forget stickers. So I just saw them in here. Okay. Here's a don't forget. So I need to put this in here so that way I can make sure Ryan, and I'll do a bigger box, I can make sure Ryan does his hair Tuesday night she has a, oh she has a volleyball game I need to put that down so don't forget grow picture day so we'll put this in and let's see if I can straighten this up okay so picture day ryan's gonna have to wash his hair i'm gonna put green in about the volleyball game so that way i can remember she's not gonna have a private lesson tomorrow just because i canceled it and then she also worked so what am i putting here picture day volleyball 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 game so i'm looking for this here let's see we'll use this one here i wanted a pom-pom and i'm not sure who we're playing but i just want to put a volleyball game on this one and i think it's this weekend Oh, you know, I know who it is because it's the same team we play Friday night. So, volleyball. At 6.30. So, that's Tuesday. And then she also needs to do Ryland's hair. I'm going to come in with another one for the football game. We'll use this one here. So football game. Let's use this one. And I'm so glad it's not that far away. It's like right up the street. So like 15, 20 minutes. Football game. I messed that up. Football game. at six what am i doing the football game is not at 6 30 it is at seven o'clock so we got to use this one here i'm not going to wipe that out anymore so football game at seven o'clock i don't know why but i always like to put asterisks down so football here yeah, I'm so glad it's not that far. But guess what? He has another cross-country race Saturday morning. Okay, let's see here. And then, oh, you know what? We got to go pick up her mom Sunday. Okay. I need to put, do I have a don't forget? Do I have another don't forget? Did I use them all? Mm, I need to schedule for me 
a, a manicure too. Okay, don't forget. Don't forget. This is really important. That'll pick up her mom. Don't forget. Let's do this one here. Let's do this one. And I think sometime this week they're going to announce who made the homecoming court. So pick up mom at I think it's at 6 30. I don't can't remember what time it is. If that's not right, I'll go back in and change it. So we're just gonna put this right here. Okay, so pick up mom. And then Saturday he has cross country. Let's put that down. Bro has a lot of stuff. And I guess what I'll do. Um, this one here, let's see, cross country, We got to be there early so me putting this down at like eight o'clock saturday morning is okay which i know we're gonna have to leave earlier than that i just have to look at um the paperwork again or the email he'll send out another one detailing everything so cross country church pick up mom cheer practice football game volleyball game picture day cheer practice Something else I'm missing. She works tomorrow night. Um, I've got to pay the deposit for her senior pictures. Let's see. Let me put another don't forget. So senior pictures are on the 18th. Not the 18th, it's on the 8th of October. And I got to pay deposit. Pay senior picks deposit. And that is $50. I need to ask her and make sure, but I'm pretty sure it does. Does this deposit go towards the cost of the pictures? I don't want to assume anything. I just want to ask just to make sure. So we got that there. See your pictures. I need to order her yearbook. I need to order her yearbook. Jeez, that's coming up quick. That is coming up really, really quick. Um, Maybe I'll put, no, I'm going to put it over here. Order yearbook. How do I want to put this, though? I'll put it here. Oh, you know what I'm missing? My son has. We have a meeting at 3.15 on Wednesday. 315 Let's see, 3.15 parent meeting okay so we'll put this here okay so 315 parent meeting Thursday I don't know so trash and recycling goes out tomorrow Thursday trash goes out I think you know y'all I think this may be everything. I could just put in, I've got trash day here and then recycling day. We have this here. So let's go ahead, let's go ahead and put this down. Uh, oh, and then Sarah Marie, um, she has her new sticker release on Friday also. 
But y'all, I'm going to call this spread done. And I like how this turned out. Although I don't have my usual stickers, like I like to put in um, little icons, but it's okay. I'm using what I have. I had this kit since last year and I wanted to go ahead and use it because if not, I would not have used it. So, and then I may come in later on in the week, and if I have room to put in some of these full box stickers, maybe. So, I can put one here, here, and here. So, Sunday, don't forget. I think that's it, y'all. I hope you all enjoy getting to see my plans for the week, what we have going on, being a family of five but um with only two of my kids here in the house right now oh let me just tell y'all my daughter got approved for graduation um today so she sent us the text message i'm on i'm like look did you apply for graduation yet did you apply for graduation did you apply for graduation and so she sent the text message today in our family group chat that her graduation application was approved so we will officially have a college graduate in December. I hope you all enjoyed getting to see our plans for the week. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me over on Instagram at Plan with Rochelle. And thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.